y'all. Hello. Thanks for tuning in. Checking out my channel. I hope that you like and subscribe before you this video ends, whether you're watching it on YouTube or another social media platform. And please make sure that you check out my latest book on Amazon, Motivation and Inspiration for the People at Work. This is my latest girl. Yeah, baby. <laughs> anyway, I want to talk today about the blame game. Whether it's at work, at home, with you and your kids, you and your wife, you or your husband, you and your friends, you and your coworkers. Our inability to own our part. So that's a part of accountability to remember accountability, accounting for and having the ability to account for our shortcomings. Okay, because we don't have to be accountable for something that's so great. I mean, it's just something we did, but we need to be accountable for something where we find it to be a shortcoming. So I find that it's so common for people to be able to see what that person did and not what you did, okay? So you broke up with him and you broke up with her and you broke up with him and you broke up with her for all the same reasons, but there's nothing with you. You don't get along with that coworker or that coworker or that boss or another boss. You transfer it because you don't like them. All of that and none of it is you. Come on now, come on. It's so easy for us to see it in someone else and not in ourselves. Yet realize that we're all imperfect. You know, we're all imperfect. So how could I always be right and not you ever be right? You've always got to be wrong. Not being able to say, hey, I miss sending you that report. I should have sent you that report before I left last night. Now your stuff's late. Owning it. And accountability has parts. It is recognizing that it is your error. It is apologizing for the error. And it is only the error and not passing it on to someone else. So for example, I didn't send you that report last night. And so instead of me saying, I'm sorry, I didn't get that report to you last night. So you could have, you know, worked with whatever you needed from it today. I say, oh, well, you know, John came to my office and he said it would just take a sec and it did take a sec. You know, it never take a sec with John, you know that. So he stayed and, and I have all these reasons as to why I didn't do it. Instead of just saying, I'm sorry, I'll get that to you today. It's an oversight, you know, and just own that piece. We don't do that. We don't do it in relationships. I'm unhappy with you about what? And then I fix what you're unhappy about. And then you're unhappy with you about something else. So everything that makes you happy, even if I change it, you're still un unhappy. So is it really me? Or is it some of you? Or most of you? <laughs> so, you know, the lack of the ability to just own our peace and uh, recognize that we have a part in it is the biggest part of why we don't, we're not accountable. So go fix you. Go fix me. Fix us. Have the confidence to do that. It's okay. But a real queen recognizes, a real king recognizes and can own that stuff. Rise above that mentality. Be in a state of mind that we are all human, human, and we, and by default, we're all imperfect. But to point fingers and to blame and to lack the wherewithal to own your peace, small. The consciousness does not embrace that. Consciousness does not embrace that. It deals with you. It deals with you. 
because you are the one that needs dealing with. And it's okay. I love you. I love you enough to speak truth if I can. We all are evolving, are recognizing and all of that. And one of the first things we all should probably seek to do, this is why people say, oh, I wish I could be, you know, a little bit more patient with people. And I wish I could do this and I wish I could do that. But none of them want to start with themselves. They want to see why people don't change to fit their liking. So that's self-superiority. Mm -hmm. That's self-superiority. Everybody around me has to change for them to be acceptable to me. Nah, it don't work like that. <laughs> I love y'all. It don't work like that. So own your peace. Don't excuseify it. Don't find a reason why you didn't do it. Don't point at somebody else. Own your errors. All right. I had to go, y'all. Bye.